David Sills going against him. He's having a pretty strong camp. You know, what's it like playing against him? And what are you seeing from him? Uh, I see a crafty receiver. Uh, he's been around the league for, for a minute now. Um, so he knows some crafty moves that uh, most receivers don't know. So I see a crafty guy, good guy to go against for me. Are you, uh, how much are you looking forward to facing Odell this week? Uh, well, I'm looking forward to facing the whole Browns team. You know, they got some good receivers other than o Odell, Jarvis Landry, uh, Higgins, uh, Donovan Peoples. Uh, so they got some good receivers all across the board that I'm ready to go against. James, how much did it impact what the Giants defense could do last year that you never really settled on a corner cornerback opposite you. It just seemed like there was whoever was playing opposite you. It changed every week. Um, I don't think it affected our game plan too much because uh, we're gonna do what we do. Um, and I leave it up to uh, Coach Graham, anyways, and I just go out there and execute my assignment. So now having a Dory kind of cemented into that role, how does that change things? You know, do you expect more throws your way? Does it help you in any way? It's, you know, you get different cornerbacks, but you know who's opposite you. Um, of course, he's a, a great cornerback to, um, to kind of compete against on the other side. Uh, so he's going to make plays, and it's going to drive me to make more plays. So I'm looking forward to it. Good popping up on these uh, top 100 lists. What, is, what does that sort of mean to you? And that, what do you think people are finally realizing? Um, it's pretty cool. You know, I used to watch this show when I was in college a lot, uh, when I was during the summer or when it would come on. Uh, so it's pretty cool to see my name come up on there. Um, I don't think. I just, like, like you said on the thing, I've been under the radar, I guess. Like, people haven't really noticed me or whatnot, but that's cool with me, too. You know, I'm just, I just want to play good ball. I'm that your teammates or, or peers around the league are voting on as opposed to, you know, outside people, media, or what have you. Does it mean a little bit more that, like, people on the field are seeing that? Oh, uh, yeah, it feels good, you know, that my counterparts, you know, they're witnessing what I do. Um, and um, what's his name? Uh, Trey, Del Trey, uh, Trey White. You know, he mentioned that I watch a lot of film, which I actually do. So it's good um, to see a peer of mine recognize the work that I put in. How much do you think your recognition, obviously you had a great year, but how much of it do you think has to do with being here? Like you're a free agent who cho chose the biggest city in America. Not everybody would do that. How much do you think has to do with the New York spotlight? I definitely think it has somewhat to do with it. You know, of course, we play on TV more. This is the, the New York football giants. A lot of people recognize this, this logo and whatnot. So I think it has something to do with it. So should we take credit for that then? Because we're all the media here hyping you up. Uh, sure, I'll give y'all some credit. Say no more. Sure. <laughs>